I just realized nothing could be boring. Well, nothing could be, like, ununique. Like, things can be boring, but it can't be the, like, most ununique. Like, the most boring day wasn't boring. Because it being the most boring day makes it interesting. And then the second most boring day would be the true most boring day then. But if it's the most boring day, it's interesting. And, like, take the most average, like, boring person in the history of ever. Like, the most statistically average person to ever live. That person was extremely interesting because they were interesting because they were the most bo- like boring normal average person to ever exist so that would mean the second most per- most like average person to ever exist would be the true most boring person but then they would be special because of that and then by after like the 10th point they already have like, a couple special things going on, so they're just, like, automatically special, so it makes nothing not special, like, any, like, even if there were, like, a million of the exact same thing, like, the 200 inch, the 200, the 200,000, I don't know, like, the 200,000, Three two hundred thirty four thousand five hundred sixty seven is the, is unique because it goes up and like the first one is unique and then the most like not recognized one like the hardest to guess out of the a million would be unique because it's it's the most like the least likely for somebody to guess but then the second would also be unique because. Well, it's more likely to guess, but also it'd be the true most likely to guess, too. And then just keep going until it gets to like one million, one, five hundred million, just the ones that people will just average and guess, you know? And then, like, it makes everything special no matter what.